Hi guys, it's Tekka536 here and I've got another video for you today um, how to get past school internet restrictions um, in five steps. Okay, and um, these are five steps which you can try, they're not guaranteed to work, but most of the time they do work, so let's get straight into it. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is head over here um, up into the address bar. Um, you see here you've got your you've got your social, just the address. Um, and then here you've got your HTTP. So what you want to do is after the P, you just go ahead and type in an S. Um, and this will just this will then go ahead and press Enter. And this will take this. If this doesn't work, then I've got another step to help this work. Um, but try this first. It's a good step. Usually, most of the time, it does work. Okay. So here's the second step. You've um, you've tried the first step, HTTPS, um, and it hasn't worked. So then you type it into Google. You type what you want into Google, um, and then you go down here. And Google is this cool thing where if you come here, then and click on the down arrow, and then click on cached, and it comes up with the Google snapshot of how it appeared on the first of April. And if this is still blocked, sometimes this is still blocked because Google uh, sometimes school doesn't allow that. Um, come up here do the HTTPS thing and then you're away and but it although it does come up in this format if there's any sort of text that you want then you can use it and it still works um, this doesn't work for login sites like Facebook or Twitter because um, once you've logged in it, it reverses all of this and um, because Google can't take a snapshot um, a snapshot of um, a personal page Okay, so um, that's number two. Okay, so you've tried that and it hasn't worked and you still can't get past these internet restrictions. Okay, so let's go on to the third method. Um, you want to get command prompt open. So on Windows 8, you're going to go um, start and then type in CMD. Um, there you go. Um, gets command prompt open for you. Um, if you're on Windows XP, then go start run. Um, if you're on, and type in CMD, and then if you're in Windows 7, then type in start CMD and it'll come up. And also, if it, you're at school and this doesn't work, you can't get command prompt open because they block it often and because it's got quite a large capability, then go ahead and um, watch my other video, which I'll have up soon, which will show you how to get, pa how to get command prompt on any computer. Okay, so here you go. So, what you want to type into command prompt is ping, P A N G. Google, I'm just going to use Google as an example, .co.uk, ping google.co.uk, and press enter. And you see here it's got the um, it's got the IP address of that website. So then you go ahead and type it into your browser over here. 173.194, um, okay I've done this already, so there you go, it comes up with it. Just type it in, press it. A lot and it will come up with it. Um, so that's another thing to try um, at school. Okay, guys, um, if that didn't work and you still haven't got, if st and it st that still hasn't been successful, then we've got a few more things to try for you. Okay, so first of all, I want you to go to um, type into Google Translate and it will come up with Google Translate. So go ahead and click on Google Translate. Okay, from here. Um, you have to go over, click on Spanish, um, Spanish to English, you want it. And then, um, as you can see here, type text or website address to translate. Um, so, that means that you can type in any website and it should translate it. So, we'll type in uh, YouTube.com. And it'll come up here, so you go ahead and click over, click, click over here. Go translating, and then it'll come up with YouTube. Um, and you should be able to use YouTube just out of here. Okay, sometimes Google Translate doesn't work um, that well, so you go over to Prompt, type in Prompt into Google, um, go Spanish to English, and we'll type in YouTube again. Translate. And this screen will pop up. Loading at the top here. Okay, and then there you go, you've got YouTube. Um, that should work. Um, that should work. And if it doesn't, then we've got one more step for you guys. Okay, so if you haven't had any success um, so far and um, nothing I've said before has worked, 
um, head over to anonymouse.org and as you can see it's spelled like this up here um, go ahead and click on English and the way this works is it bypasses the school proxies um, and you can just read this if you want this is not it doesn't really apply to apply to this because it's um, it's different it's different what we're trying to achieve but it does the same thing so then go um, let's type in YouTube dot com um, and click on surf anonymously okay um, you have adverts which is a which is a um, downside of this which is a downside of this um, you can just click X on them and get them, get rid of them um, and you can see you got YouTube there um, and at the top here look, it's got all this prefix um, and it's got YouTube and non -emoused. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Please like, it only takes a second, but it really helps. Be subscribe um, for more um, videos, and I'll be putting up that command prompt video soon. So, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video.